Well hello YouTubers, how you guys doing? For today's review, I bring you here this 2009 Chevy Silverado 3500 HD Duramax. I've been recently trying to find some more Duramax Chevys as well as GMCs to try and video and suddenly I've come across this one and I just couldn't pass out the opportunity. But anyway, this is going to be a full and in-depth review of the Silverado. We'll start the engine, show it off, go some of the performance specifications, and we'll show you a bunch of the unique and interesting aspects on the overall interior as well as the exterior. Starting off with the exterior, this exterior color is known as Onyx Black. Anyway, please pardon, that is a little dirty. Has had some use out of it over the years. But anyway, right here is its aggressive brush guard. Really rough. Really aggressive looking too. And this is the LTZ package, so it's fully loaded. And right here is its factory 17s, or could be 16s, Chevy rims. Wrapped in, wrapped in Nito Terra. Grape line tires, grape line tires, excuse me, all ter they are all terrain. It does have running bars on the side. Oh, and by the way, it is a dually. And it is a 4x4. And on the back, it does have a towing package. And on the back of the bed, ugh. It does have the bed liner in it. You have a really good amount of bed space. And right here is there's a little toolbox right up. And then the third wheel hitch right right there. Now we're gonna shut this. Continue on. There's the exhaust tip. You have do have the factory Chevy mud guards. And by the way, the mud guards are plastic, they aren't those rubber ones. But anyway, that's all on the exterior of this truck. Now, before I go on the interior, I'm going to show you something that's really cool. It does have a remote start activated right here. How it works is you lock the truck, hold the top button down. Simple as that. And to turn it off, just hit the button again. Now we'll go on the interior. Inside, it's got an ebony leather interior. You have all your power options here, power windows, power mirrors, window locks, and power door locks. I'll go ahead and jump inside. Ooh. Really nice looking truck. Now we'll go ahead and start the engine here. Got about 68,000 miles on its odometer. Really nice use out of it over the years. But anyway, this truck is a diesel, so you have to wait for the glow plug to go off. But as I've seen on a lot of these Duramaxes, the glow plugs warm up really fast. But anyway, now we'll go ahead and start it up. Awesome sound. It's got a full leather wrapped steering wheel. Nice and smooth power assisted steering. It's got a six speed Allison transmission with low gear selection and manual shiftability by the plus and minus on the side of the shifter. And also your numbers show up right up in the dash. And plus since this has the navig navigation screen it does have a reverse backup camera. Just put it in reverse and it automatically starts up. Please well, it is a little hot, so it's, it's not working the best, but anyway. After putting in park neutral or drive, it goes away. But anyway, let's go ahead and cut on the headlights. It does have automatic lights, fog lights, and the hazards. Driver's side window is automatic. I'm going to go ahead and check out the exterior.
Got a really nice sounding engine. But anyway, I'll go ahead and back up. Ugh. And shut off the headlights and hazards. But now, I'm gonna pop the hood and show the engine. At the business end of this Silverado 3500 HD, we find the LMM 6.6 .6 liter Duramax turbo diesel V8. These are really awesome engines. I personally am a huge fan of these engines. They're very powerful. They tow really good. And it's just an amazing engine for an amazing truck. Go ahead and shut the hood here. Now I'll go ahead and jump back inside. Ugh. Now we'll go ahead and see how it sounds. Beautiful sounding engine. Your parking brakes right down here. Just press to set. And the indicator shows up right up in the dash. And then pull this lever here to release. Now go ahead and shut the door. Roll up the window. Now go ahead and check the sound system. Anderson, financial guy from Ace Cash Express. Mark, what kind of special savings do you have? It does have an AM FM stereo with an XM satellite radio. And also a CD deck right up here. Right here's all your radio controls down here. It does have navigation. And there's a map right there. Sorry, it's a little hard to see because it's sunny outside. The sun glare is hitting the screen. Anyway, right here. There's no risk to try us out. If you change your mind, simply bring back the money, and we'll call it even. Stop by the Ace Cash Your radio, more radio controls. Like Mark says, what unexpected. Also, there's an AUX control right up here. Loans arranged by Ace Credit Access, subject to approval. You have an easy-to-use climate control. Always use short-term. It also has a dual climate control. Repayment of single payment anyway, only. Right here. To installment Here's your, your, your different zones. 2013. Certain conditions apply. Please visit the store. Power for outlets details. down Ace here. Express. Earning your trust since 19. Parking assist lights. Power pedal adjustment. Love box. Also in amount of storage right up in the center. You do have multifunction controls on the steering wheel. Here, your channel controls, hands-free Bluetooth, radio controls, and volume controls are on the back. You know, your cruise controls right here. Your visor, the vanity mirror on it, it's a little bit hard to see. Uh, right up here is your home link garage system. Your reading lights are right here. You do have an auto dimming rear view mirror right up here with OnStar, which comes standard on all General Motors vehicles. You have all your driver information settings right up here. Your wiper controls are over here. And your four wheel drive controls are right over here. Let me show you it operating. Once you start putting it into four-wheel drive, it starts flashing to let you know that its electronic shift is in process. Like that. You integrated trailer brakes right down here. Ugh. I'll then show you all the back seat. Pardon the stuff back here. But anyway, you have storage pockets in the back. Power outlet right down here. Right here is attached right up. So right here. Your reading lights are right here. You also do have a fold out cup holder. Right, right in the center. You do have power seats, power sliding, tilting, recline, lumbar support. 
<laughs> it also has a tilt steering wheel. Well, anyway, it's an awesome, awesome truck. I'll go ahead and shut it down here. Well, guys, hope you all enjoyed the in-depth review of this 2009 Chevy Silverado 3500 HD Duramax. Be sure to stay tuned. There'll be a lot more where that came from. Take care, guys.